Hey guys, I'm back, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you all of the DVDs I added to my collection last month in April 2022. Um, there aren't really that many things here, um, because as I said in my collection update for March 2022, uh, you know, I, I'm trying to, you know, spend less money on DVDs and stuff because I always just buy so many. Um, so yeah, there aren't really that many, uh, you know, this month, but yeah, these are the ones I got. So without further ado, let's begin with this collection update video. Also, sorry if you notice if like the, the camera is like a bit higher up. Uh, than usual. The way I film my videos is incredibly cheap. I literally just have my camera sitting on a cardboard box. Um, and uh, yeah, I, I got a new cardboard box to um to sit my tablet on. So uh, so yeah, the, if you notice that, that's why. So first up, at the beginning of the month, I picked up Aliens on Blu-ray from Amazon. And uh, I've really, really been wanting to get the other uh, Alien movies on Blu-ray for uh, quite a while now because I really love the artwork that uh, this particular series has on uh, each of the, um, the Blu-rays. Um, and uh, yeah, the first one out of these I've gotten is uh, Aliens, and I'll be getting the rest of the Alien movies on Blu-ray quite soon. And next up, the only new release of April that I picked up was uh, Spider-Man No Way Home. Um, and there were uh, quite a couple of new releases uh, last month, which I do kind of want to pick up, like um, Death on the Nile and Scream 2022. But they released Death on the Nile in a two-pack box set with uh, Murder on the Orient Express, which I was really hoping they would do, and they did, so I'm very happy about that. So I'll probably pick that up eventually. Um, so uh, yeah, Spider-Man No Way Home, uh, this came out at the uh, the beginning of April, and of course I picked it up. Um, yeah, I think it's a really fantastic Spider-Man movie. Uh, so yeah, um, and finally for this um, this uh, collection update, uh, I went to um, to HMV in uh, in April, and um, there were three things that I picked up. So um, the first one was the uh, the Robocop trilogy. Um, in my uh, collection update for uh, March 2022, I had a Robocop 2014 uh, in that one because I found that at a CEX. Um, and, uh, yeah, I just, I want to get the, uh, the Robocop trilogy to, you know, complete my, uh, my Robocop collection. And, uh, yeah, so, um, I have the, uh, the Robocop trilogy and I have done a review on this and Robocop 2014 as well. Next up from HMV, I picked up Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Um, and, uh, I've had so many opportunities to get this DVD since it came out in 2019. Um, and I, I just never have, uh, uh, for some reason. Um, but yeah, I finally got it, uh, last month in April, um, and, uh, yeah, the sequel to this film, unfortunately, got delayed to 2023, which I am very, very unhappy about, because, you know, it was originally coming out in April 2022, so we had long enough to wait as it is, um, but yeah, now we have to, to wait, uh, to, uh, to 2023 for Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse Part 1, but yeah, I am definitely looking forward to the, uh, the, uh, the sequel to this great, great Spider-Man movie. Uh, and uh, finally, um, for uh, of what I picked up last month uh, in April, this this had to be like the the biggest like you have got to be kidding me moment I've ever had in my entire life. So on the HMV website, uh, their their copy of Fast and Furious Six um is a a cover to go along with um the the series of the first five Fast and Furious movies on DVD that I have. Um, but for some reason, every time I went into HMV, I could never ever find it, and they only had a, this copy there instead. So I literally ordered the um the uh the 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 DVD that was on the website. I literally ordered it from the website. Um, you know the the one with the the cover they were advertising, and they still delivered this one. Like uh, they, yeah, it was still this DVD. And for some reason, when I went into HMV in April, they had it, and like I've never seen this DVD in my life. Like I cannot find it anywhere, and for some reason, it was a HMV, which you know, the, the, you know, I, I can't believe it. Like it really, really annoyed me because I just got that a copy of Fast and Furious Six for no reason. Um, but you know, uh, yeah, that that did annoy me quite a bit. But I'm also very happy about the fact that I do finally have this copy on DVD. Um, so yeah, that's uh, Fast and Furious Six, the uh, the the 2017 copy. Um, so yeah, uh, thank you very much for watching this collection update video. If you did enjoy, please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you want to. And until next time, bye bye.